All right. So I got word from a local about this tree. I'm in some unchartered territory on top of Tertullius Point. Um, I just sent, just made a few videos from some of the views looking down um, at Honolulu. But we have here a very, very um, interesting uh, DNA artifact. I'm not too sure. Is this a mutation? But this is something I want to turn the camera around. This is something you uh, who are definitely into finds would find very, very interesting. Check it out. Here it is, y'all. We don't have a name for the tree yet. I'm going to do some research. I'm making this video before I do the research for the name of the tree. It was described to me from a, by a local. And uh, it, it's not even far off the road. Look how close off the road it is. Again, most of this territory, there's the road down there. If you look over, you can see where, my, where I'm parked over there. But this area is very un uninhabited. Not many folks. And here is the main event. Check out this tree. Uh, this is exactly how the tree was described to me. This is part of the tree's root. The trunk. Look at this. been here looks like they tug up their names so I'm gonna do some research to the name of this tree you can hear the beautiful birds chirping and this is truly a tree's world right here at Tatasula point about 20 minutes from Honolulu overlooking the city of Waikiki and Honolulu. Amazing, y'all. Amazing find. So you saw it here first. I brought this to y'all. Uh, I appreciate and, and I'm honored and humbled to have been able to be the person to introduce you to this tree where you can do your own research on and possibly find, find this tree. It's native, if, if it's native to Hawaii or if this tree, um, you know, what's its origin? What's its ge 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 uh, geographical origin? And a little bit of the science on why and how it its roots build like this.